Hey, good morning, everyone. It's uh, Glenn Kellaway from the basement um, in a stupid birthday hat with candles all over the top of it. It's, yes, it's my birthday today, number 69. Wow, how time flies. I still feel like I'm 16, but uh, when I get up in the morning and put my foot on the floor, I realize I'm 69. Um, I got some stuff from my wife and my uh, little guy, Peyton. And um, I'm pretty excited. I wanted to show you a couple of records and then talk about something. First of all, I got a couple of Amazon gift cards. And I already had like 50 bucks in gift cards. So I got like $100 worth of Amazon gift cards, which is going to be spent very quickly this morning. Um, I already have stuff in the cart. So uh, I'll be back in a couple of days to show you what I got. Um, first off, you know, uh, I'm a Nick Cave fan and um, becoming more so every day every new album that I listen to or album that I explore guy's amazing um, this is his newest release with his kind of partner in crime Warren Ellis called Carnage so I'm dying to hear this um, big Nick Cave fan if you're not familiar with his stuff I discovered him through watching that show Peaky Blinders on Netflix which is one of my favorite shows I've ever watched if you haven't seen it and um, they used his song Red Right Hand as a uh, theme song. And I went, who the hell is that? And checked it out and then started listening and bought a Nick Cave's Best Of uh, CD and then bought a couple of others. And, and recently, like in the last year or so, Ghostine. Um, um, yeah, just a great, great singer-songwriter. So there's the album. Let's see what's going on here comes in quite a heavy cardboard thingy. I'm going to have to take that out. I love that. I listen to music with pretty low light, and when you take a record out of a sleeve and you look at it, most of the time you can't tell what's side A and side B unless you go turn a light on and look. But when these, these uh, when they we put an A and a B that big, that's uh, speaking out to me. Um, let's see this book here. Okay, uh, yeah, it's just lyrics. It's all lyrics, but uh, very cool. Nick Cave, if you haven't listened to him, check him out. Um, I've been dying to get my hands on this. My friend Jamie Cottle just showed an unboxing of this yesterday that I watched, and I was drooling through the whole thing. Zappa Eerie. This is a six-CD set. Frank Zappa live in the Erie, Pennsylvania area from 1974 through to 1976, I believe. Um, six CDs. Let's open this baby up and see what's going on. Hope everybody's having a wonderful day today. Well, I'm opening this up. Uh, this is what I wanted to tell you. 3.30 this afternoon, my friend Rich Strickler is hosting the Glenn Kellaway birthday party. Um, I think a few people are going to show up. I sure hope so. Uh, you're all welcome. Come on and say hello. Rich will be running the thing. So if you don't know Rich's channel, I hope you do. Uh, please check it out if you got nothing going on, 3.30 to 5.30. We don't know who's going to show up. Um, I heard Paul McCartney might be coming, and maybe uh, I, uh, I think Larry Graves is asking Sean and Yoko to come on too. So uh, hype sticker we're going to keep. And let's see what's going on here with this thing. So there's three CDs there's three more CDs and in the middle of the CDs it looks like a book Zappa Erie uh, then it just gives a rundown for each CD and who's in the band the band was great at this time because this was kind of the apostrophe period. Uh, it's George Duke, Tom Fowler on bass, G Jeff Simmons, guitar and vocals, Don Preston, synthesizer, Bruce Fowler, trombone, Walt Fowler, trumpet, 
Napoleon Murphy Brock, tenor sax, flute, and lead vocals, Ralph Henry on drums, Chester Thompson on drums. Um, wow. So, uh, 13 minute version of Cosmic Debris on here. Inca Rhodes is on here. Montana's on here. Uh, CD2. Uh, wow, this. Camarillo Brillo, more every more trouble every day. So there's some classic Zappa on here too. Very cool uh, pictures. Um, yeah, I love those. Very cool. This set is really expensive, ridiculously expensive. And if it hadn't have been a gift, I'm not sure uh, I wouldn't have waited until. I had, uh, it came down in price. Another uh, CD5 I'm up to now with uh, Terry Bozio on drums, uh, Ray White on guitar and vocals, Lady Bianca on keyboards and vocals. I'm not sure how crazy I'm going to be about that. Um, there's another of the band from uh, on CD3 that has Ruth Underwood, one of my favorite players who played with Zappa. Um, this is just going to be a great set. I'm really excited uh, to check it out. So I will let you know how it is. So that's it. 3.30 this afternoon, please. Go over to Rich Strickler's channel. The best birthday present you could give me is to subscribe to Rich's channel. Let's get him up to uh, 500 subscribers. Um, everybody have a great day. Thank you so much.